Hi, everyone. Uh, it's great to be with you today. It's Monday, February 28th. Hope you had a great weekend. I hope you were able to join us in worship uh, yesterday, either online or in person. Uh, our, our focus was uh, in Mark chapter 7, uh, is, is the heart of the matter, is, is that it's a matter of the heart, right? That, um, and, and I believe that, in a nutshell, is what this chapter, Mark 7, is about. But we really talked about that. We talked about how God, uh, throughout his word, focuses on the heart. Love the Lord your God with all your heart soul, mind, and strength, and love your neighbor, love, again, this love and this heart business is, it comes in, love your neighbor, where, how, from the heart, as, as yourself, I, I used, uh, to open the message yesterday, I used this, uh, this, this ditty from, uh, Phil on the Roof, right, and he asked his wife, do you love me, after 25 years of marriage, right, they'd have been an arranged marriage, and they, they, they have kind of done the right stuff, right, they, they, um, they, they, they did what they were supposed to, they were committed to that, but now, his daughters are talking, about love and he's saying Yildi do you love me <laughs> and and she didn't want to and, and she's doing this and that I, for 25 years I've done this and that but do you love me and and she says finally she says I suppose I do and he says I love you too and and our hearts go out because we know that's what life's about uh, and we know that because that's how God created us he created us uh, the the very essence of our being the very seed of, of everything we are our heart um, to, uh, to, to love God and, and to love one another. And when that's straight, then everything flows from that. And that's what this chapter is about because so often we make, it, we make life and even right and wrong and whether we're right with God or not, uh, we, we make it hinge on what we do as opposed to who we are in a sense in him. Uh, you know, throughout the Bible, it, it, it talks about this. In, in the Old Testament, it, you had this circumcision, right? If you had to be, if you're gonna be part of the people of God, you had to be circumcised. And yet the Bible in the Old Testament talks about uh, you need to be circumcised in your heart. And it, 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 that picks it up like in, in the New Testament. Well, in fact, in Romans, it says this, uh, a man is not a Jew if he is only one outwardly, nor is circumcision merely outward and physical. No, a man is a Jew uh, if he is one inwardly. Uh, and circumcision is circumcision of the heart. Uh, I should have paid clip that. So um, by the spirit not by the written code. Such a man's praise is from men, it is not from men, but from God. And so Old Testament and New Testament is the idea of the heart. Uh, and we forget that in, in, in so many ways uh, that, that it's about the heart. Uh, in, in, um, in Hebrews, I just ran across this. I want to show this. It says, see to it, brothers and sisters, that none of you has a sinful, unbelieving heart that turns away from the living God. See, it's about the heart. Uh, but encourage one another daily as long as it is called today so that none of you may be hardened by sin's deceitfulness. You know, and, and it reminds me of Pharaoh in the Old Testament. Uh, he kept hardening his heart, hardening his heart, hardening his heart towards God. God kept trying to get through to the heart. And he kept hardening his heart. And so this, this reminds me of that. You know, and, and in the book of Proverbs, it, it says, above all else, guard your heart. This, this, this tie-in of love. Uh, and the essence of who we are with this, this compassionate, loving God uh, with whom we were created to have relationship, right? This, this is the essence of this chapter. Uh, uh, in, in, this, in the middle of this chapter, G Jesus says this, uh, what comes out of a man is what makes him unclean, but from within, out of men's hearts, come evil thoughts, sexual immorality, theft, murder, adultery, greed, malice, deceit, lewdness, envy, slander, arrogance, and folly, all these evils come from what from inside and make a man unclean. The idea here was, as we'll see tomorrow a little bit, the, the uh, Jewish leaders are saying what a guy does on the outside, what a person does on the outside makes one thing. He said, no, it's all about the heart. And, and this is the, the – this, and we, um, we lose this idea. So much of the time we make life about stuff we do uh, as opposed to – who we are in Jesus first and who we are in love towards those around us. And then the things we do flow from that. Uh, and, and you do it the other way. You tend to have, you make your own kingdom as opposed to the kingdom of Jesus Christ, the, the kingdom of love. Now, I, I want to, I closed the message this Sunday, and I, but I wanted to open the week with this. Ready? It's a little song. Uh, you can, it goes like this. Come into my heart. Come into my heart. Come into my heart, Lord Jesus. Come in today, come in to stay. Come into my heart, Lord Jesus. We know we that know the Lord Jesus Christ, and we can we can pray that and sing that every single day. 
because uh, we want to remember that it's always a matter of the heart. We want our hearts. It says, guard your heart. Well, this is one way to do it, uh, to maybe pray that every day, uh, sing that every day. So let, let's do it one more time. Ready? Come into my heart. Come into my heart. Come into my heart, Lord Jesus. Come in today. Come in to stay. Come into my heart, Lord Jesus. Would you pray with me? Dearest Jesus, we thank you that you loved us so much that you went the way of the cross. It was because your heart reached out to us. You had compassion for us who were lost from you and couldn't find our way back to God. And we were condemned um, and, and we had no hope. But you came, Lord. You bridged the gap between God, uh, the Father, and us. You, you took our punishment on yourself. You, out of your great love for us, um, you restore you you did all that needs to be done to restore us to yourself so that we can just receive that by faith we pray lord that um, every day you might renew our hearts and that we might live out that reality that we love because you first loved us uh, give us joy in your cross and joy in sharing your love we pray in your name amen okay we'll see you tomorrow may god be with you bye-bye